Couldn't think of a more fitting end. Runner Fox had it coming. As much as it tickles me too, we got a Delta. Right, still got Mr. Grumps left.
look. See that? Fuck those cunts. You watching a story on the Arisakas or narrating porn? Gee, aren't you funny? Look around. Look what they've done to this hood. This is the part where you divulge your master plan to annihilate Arisaka? No. It's the part where I say I despise petty merc thieves who think they're hot shit rebels after setting foot in the afterlife. Might think you took on Arasaka, but you're just a bug they scraped off the sole of their boot and tossed in the trash. Ain't the only one to get flatlined by Sokka. Except I didn't let him scoop out my mind. Did you lock it in a trinket? Ha! Huh. I brought war to their doorstep, kid. Your grand plan? To steal their fucking car. You seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seeing flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Don't think I care. What does interest me is why you're a clingy creep. I think we can work together, V. But your plans make no sense. Destroy Arisaka? I, I don't even know what that means. All in good time. Your goal is to bury Arisaka. Demolish it. Mine's to stay above ground. Seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually aligned pretty nicely, too. You need Mikoshi to save your life? That done, I can burn it to the ground. Okay, I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits. Broken dreams and empty pockets. Corps have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. <laughs> Come on, don't exaggerate. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Fucking hell. You still don't see it. But you will one day. Ah, shit! Arguing with you is pointless. You started it. Hey, V! Over here, Chum! 
What's up, Kirk? Happy to see you too, but how about let's not broadcast it, hmm? Right, right, sorry. No need for a scene. Okay, see that garage right there? Van's inside. You go in, grab the tech, get out, we split it 50-50. Clear? I thought this was a job for two. Looks like I'm carrying all the weight here. All the weight? All the fucking weight? Who's gonna keep watch? Me, of course. Anything happens, you'll know. You scan the area, anyone inside? All clear, V. Not a soul can waltz right in like you own the place. Okay, in I go. Head on a swivel, right? You got it. Walk. I'll clear my ass. What is this? Close? Mm -hmm. Cheap knockoffs, too. Had real great intel, that Kirk. Like always, actually. But hey, could strike out on your own. Open up a stand in Kabuki, or maybe. Implants. Fucking Militech wear. I'm gonna shove these duds right up his ass. Just getting started. Have a good time, V. Oh, fuck you, hey, fuck. This stuff's 
got my senses boosted. Oh, uh, Here up, puto. How you like those combat implants, Chew? <laughs> Very funny. To you. The fuck is going on here? You're Chun Kirk. Did biz time to time, but see, had this funny feeling he was trying to play me. Checked out that feeling. Told him I had a transport, cream implants, just sitting there for the taking. And I went. I am a fucker. See the crank worked. <laughs> yep, sure did. Isn't that right, boys? I should splatter you brains on the pavement, but I'd just be wasting lead. Only a fucking gonk could run an op with Kirk. Hey, don't give me that face. You are what you fucking do. So say it. Say you're a gonk little bitch and I'll let you live. I'm a gonk little bitch. You happy? Smart boy. Right, Junes? Let's Delta. Well, that's what you get for a lifetime of us. Nice speech. Remind me not to invite you to my funeral. How about him? Gonna tell anyone to scrape him up and put him under? No one to tell. <laughs>